Ancient Egyptian burials were carefully designed to protect the deceased and ensure a smooth journey to the afterlife. Each component of the burial played a specific role in preservation, protection, and spiritual guidance. At the heart of the burial was the mummified corpse, the preserved body of the deceased. Wrapped in linen bandages and treated with resins, mummification was essential for keeping the body intact for eternity. Embalmers meticulously removed internal organs, drying the body with natron salts to prevent decomposition. Amulets and charms were placed between the wrappings, offering protection and blessings for the afterlife. Encasing the mummy were the bandages and funerary mask, an additional layer that sometimes included a painted or gilded face resembling the deceased. This layer was essential for both physical preservation and spiritual recognition. Once embalmers wrapped the body tightly, inscriptions and protective spells were added to guard the soul and ensure its safe passage to the afterlife. In some periods, particularly during the Roman era in Egypt, mummification also included the use of mummy portraits. These were realistic painted depictions of the deceased, created on wooden panels and placed over the face of the wrapped mummy. Unlike traditional funerary masks, these portraits captured individual features with remarkable detail, blending Egyptian burial customs with Greco-Roman artistic influence. They were primarily found in sites like Fayum, leading to the term Fayum portraits. These portraits ensured the deceased's identity remained intact, allowing their soul to recognize its body in the afterlife. Some burials contained multiple coffins, depending on the period and the status of the deceased. High-ranking individuals, especially royalty and nobility, were often buried in a set of nested coffins, each offering an additional layer of protection. The inner coffin, the first actual wooden coffin, enclosed the mummy and was usually made of wood or cartonage. It was richly decorated with inscriptions, religious texts, and symbolic artwork reinforcing beliefs in resurrection. Some were shaped to resemble the deceased, allowing their soul to recognize its body in the afterlife. Enclosing the inner coffin was the outer coffin, the largest wooden coffin, often adorned with hieroglyphs, divine imagery, and protective spells. Pharaohs and high-ranking officials sometimes had these outer coffins covered in gold leaf, signifying their royal and divine status.